In today's video, we are gonna make a beat that sounds like this. How's it going everybody? You know who it is, my name is Sanwu and in today's video we are gonna make a beat on the OPZ from scratch and it's gonna be something boom bapish with a sad vibe to it. So let's get straight into it, bang bang. And what better way to start a sad boom bap beat with than a melancholy piano sound. Let's filter this a tiny bit. and step record our notes. Let's have a listen and add some reverb to it. Now let's add a few more notes to it. Okay, and now we can move on to the lead track. And here we got this vocal sample, which we are gonna filter. And add some effects to it. And now let's add some notes. And let's have a listen. All right, and I think now it's time for a bit of drums, starting with the hi-hat. And we're gonna use this hi-hat here. Put it here, shift it to the right, and I am going to copy it over quite a few times and now we're going to use this step component here in order to edit the velocities. First I'm going to give these one a velocity of 5 and these ghost notes here a velocity of 2 and the others stay the same and Let's have a listen and filter it. And now the snare drum. This is our snare drum. I'm gonna put it here, but I'm gonna filter the snare drum a little bit so I get more of that boom bappy flavor by eliminating some of the high frequencies. Yep, that's much better. And now the kick drum. We're gonna create a very simple pattern. I'm gonna shift this one slightly to the right and lower the velocity. And let's hear it. Now we go to the sample track where we add a little more percussion. Nothing fancy here. Just this one and this one. And we're gonna filter it a bit again. Okay, now it's time for bass line, I think. Let's filter the bass. recorded. Yeah, 
good enough, I think. Let's move on to the tape track. Again, the tape track I'm using in a super simple way as well. It is only affecting the audio coming from the hi-hat. And I'll put one trigger down, extend it over the whole 16 steps. And it's tuned all the way down, meaning it plays one octave lower than our original hi-hat track. And this is what it sounds like. Only one track left, let's move to the arpeggiator track. And here we got this little organ sound, which we can filter a bit. And add some delay as well. them was off so I'm just gonna copy the notes over and I think then we should be all right. And that already means we have all the parts for our beat done. As always all we need to do now is some magic in order to arrange this beat. If you want to know how the magic is done check the video up there or contact me for private online lessons. Link in the description. Other than that Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate a like and a comment down below. And if you feel like it, subscribe to the channel and ring the bell so you don't miss the next video. I hope to see you next time. Until then, have a wonderful time. Peace.